Hello. There you are. I was hiding behind my little leprechaun. And his name is Colossus. And it's a really brilliant story. Hello, John Thompson. Hello, Fraser Matthew. Hello, Rob Payne. Hello. Oh, hi, Fraser, mate. And nice to see you. I've got the old brown derby on tonight. I'm doing the Irish team. And I've got my leprechaun Colossus with me. And Colossus has had a bit of a hard life because we found him working in a brothel on the border of Czech Republic and Germany. And I can't believe I haven't written that story in my book about the rescue of Colossus. And then when he came home, it was even tougher. He had to live in the garden until I brought him back in. Hello, Glyn. Hello, Mark. Hello, Mark. Yeah, yeah, everybody's here. It's brilliant to see everybody. Um, has every, I know Mark's been to football. I know Sherry's been to Emsworth, which is near where my friend Colin lives. And Ferriol is in there in Horsham. Martin Searle went to the football. Hello, Kath. Nice to see you back. You've had a significant birthday this week, Kath. Hello, Adrian. Oh, brilliant. Hello, everybody's here. We've got the gang here. We're Quora. And um, I, pro I promised you an Irish week. And, um, and I've been sitting here for the last four hours, sort of learning, relearning. Hello, Chris West. Hello, Kevin Toppin. Nice to see Kevin in Wales. Scott. We got we got America in the house, Scott. I keep forgetting where where are you in the states, Scott? You've not been well recently, but you're better. You're getting better. Stuart Blythe from Benny Billingham. I know you're in Billingham, Stuart, and I know everybody is online that's coming to see the show. And this, this is a, I'm surprised I didn't write the story. A lot of you have been buying my book and reading the book. I know that you're probably sick to death of me plugging it. But I've sold 500 copies already, and it's just incredible. Hello, Martin. Oh, yeah, Martin's got the yeah, he's got the right signage. Charlie Loveday. Hello, Charlie. Oh, great to see you here, Charlie. It's, do you know what? You really are like my family now, and I'm really looking forward to doing the show for you. It's going to be a bit maudlin and a bit... You know, I've got this chair, and it keeps going down. Has anybody got an office chair that keeps going down? Well, it's better now. So I'm going to maybe start the show a little... Many happy returns to John Thompson. John Thompson's moved to the south coast. He's got a fabulous place down there. And he says that we're all welcome to stay. And it's, this is your Saturday night. And I think you should really be chatting away to each other. And um, I'm going to sing. I know that there's trendy Irish stuff and there's not trendy Irish stuff. But I'm going to start with something that isn't trendy. I've got a great sound on the guitar. And... Um, this is just a brilliant song, and it was actually written by a man from Western Superman. And uh, we stayed, there was a plaque down there. And it's just a great killer melody. And then somebody added some words to it. And yes, we've got a special happy birthday to Kath Welby. I might even sing the whole happy birthday for her later on. Lisa Devaney from the Blue Ridge Mountains of the Virginia, yeah. Oh, Lisa, that's where all the Irish music ended up, isn't it? And they become country music. Anyway, we're going to start off with something a bit more then. Uh, hello, John Money. Hello, Lorraine Briggs. Lorraine's got a new job. Woot! She was unemployed for two minutes and now she's got a job. She's got to drive to Swindon, but hey, you can't have everything. She'd be making plans for Nigel in Swindon. Oh, yeah. Chris Thomas. Yeah. Have we got any Dannys in the house? We have Danny Ingram and sometimes Dan Healy. Hello, Kevin White. From the Isle of Wight. On the trail of the Lonesome Plan. Hello, Graham Barnfield. Thank you very much. I sent you stuff. Hello, David Jenkins. Hello everybody, we've got, ah, oh, we've smarted so, oh, the random, Fraser Matthew, yeah, you got it. Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling, from glen to glen, and down the mountainside. 
The sun is gone and all the roses falling. Tis you, tis you must go while I must hide. But come ye back when summer's in the meadow. Hello, Sherry, and all the valleys hushed and white with snow. And I'll be there in the sunshine and in shadow. Oh, Danny boy, oh, Danny boy, I love you, Cole. Then winter's come and all the flowers are dying. And I am dead. As dead as I may be, you'll come and find the place where I am lying, and kneel and say an ave just for me, and I shall hear those soft you tread above. And all my grave will warm and sweeter be. And you will bear and tell me that you love me. And I shall sleep in peace until you. The pipes, the pipes are calling from glen to glen and down the mountainside. The summer's gone and all the leaves are falling. Tis you, tis you must go. My uncle in Belfast, we had Danny Boy, and you know what? It's a tearjerker, it's a killer song. It might be maudlin, it might be old fashioned, it might not be punk, but it is a killer song. Are you ever going to use our Irish passports? I should have got the Irish passport. Do you like a bit of Danny Boy? Now, I've got loads of kind of bits and pieces, but. I wanted to talk to you about this film that I went to see last week because it's a film that I have to be keeping quiet. And it's this Shane McGowan film. I know it's backwards here. It's called Crock of Gold. And it was um, produced by Johnny Depp. And all last winter I, I worked on making a soundtrack for it. And I made some fantastic music. But when you do music for a, a film, you're not allowed to really to play it to anybody until the film comes out. So... It was really a lot of work for me and I learnt loads and loads of things and I'm going to play you some of it because it's just too good to waste. There was, I had this beautiful guy came in the studio and he played this weird thing called the Ulan Pipes and it looked like a bag of stuff with bits of blue tack stuck all over it. And uh, oh, Lynn's get, oh, Lynn, oh, Fraser's getting the DVD. Well, you won't hear this on the DVD because this is an outtake and it's beautiful. This is Fox's Lament and I'm just going to let you guys talk and listen to how... Oh, the wrong track. It was not that. That's like... Oh, I must have given the neighbours a shock. This is it. This is the track. <laughs> And in the film you see a young boy that's supposed to be Shane running across a graveyard. And this piece of music is tugging on your heartstrings. 
It's beautiful. Hello, Mike Talbot. And he's blowing into this bag. And going like this. And I'm adjusting the controls. This is amazing. And so, of course, this beautiful music goes on the film. And people watching the film are practically crying because it's so beautiful. It doesn't matter that Johnny Depp's put money into the film or Julian Temple's edited it. This piece of music is worth the admission fee itself. It's called Fox's Lament. Even I couldn't ruin it. So anyway, listen to it for a minute. One minute it sounds Irish, the next minute it sounds Mongolian. It's like a bird flying in the sky. It's fantastic. That's right, the William Pipes. Anyway, so that's one of the things I've recorded. And maybe I will be doing, when I do my Irish album later on this year, he's going to come and help me. Hello, Martin Jervis. Yeah, my, I bet Mark really missed Lorraine. Because Lorraine is like the monitor at school. And she's the one that tells everybody that they've got to do their homework and pay by the ticket. Anyway, that's beautiful. We've had a bit of this really lovely music. And uh, I'm going to sing some modern Irish music. I think I know because everybody thinks like, oh. And I don't think this is quite enough. Maybe we do this. This is quite, is it the right key? It's been seven years and fifty days. I can't remember whether I had a capo when I rehearsed it this afternoon. So, this song is a very, very famous song sung by a very, very famous Irish singer. And everybody thinks it a love song, but it's actually about smoking. No, I tell you, it's about smoking. Guess what it is? Yeah. It's been seven hours and fifteen days since you took your love away. I go out every night and I sleep all day since you took your love. gone, I go wherever I want, I see whoever I choose, I eat my dinner in a fancy restaurant, but nothing, I said nothing, take away these blues, cause now Jesus. 
She was a lovely lady. I did a, cut, a gig with her at Bubba Pub in um, All Saints Road in Notting Hill Gate, where they set the first part of that brilliant thing, Small Axe. All Saints Road used to be called the front line, where the Mangrove Cafe was. So it's all linked. Martin's got loads of friends he hasn't met yet. Did you get on with Mark? So that's nothing compares to you, and I'm going to sing old and young, and I have sort of um, I've got like already had a uh, like a I've had a request for this, and it's kind of who's I met my love. By the gas walks wall, I dreamed a dream by the old canal. I kissed my girl by the factory wall. Dirty old town, dirty old town. Clouds are drifting across the A girl from the street at night to the old town, to the old town. I heard a siren from the dark, saw a train set the night on fire. I smell the spring. Smoky wind, dirty old town, dirty old town. I met my love on the gasworks wall. I dreamed a dream by the old canal. I kissed my girl by the factory wall. Dirty old town. Good old town. There we go, dirty old town, and everybody's chatting away. I was brilliant to see everybody's really getting on, and you've got a real community, and you don't even need me anymore. So I've got another kind of little song here. We're gonna go. Oh, thank you, Saint David. Thank you for saying my voice is on good form because it doesn't feel like it to me. I've got this kind of song here that I did for the movie. Oh, I could do a Water Boys one for Judy, but I've got a special one for Judy later on. Actually, I'm going to do an Irish folk version of a song of mine that I sang the other week as reggae. And this is especially for Judy because it's all about emigration and moving to... And it's great about the diaspora, about the Irish people that moved all around the world and, and some English people as well to get a better life. A lot of people went to America to get a better life. Like John Thompson, you know, he went on one of those emigrant ships and he, and then he struck gold on the railway line and, and he, he drove a spike through the railway and now he's come back with all his money to live in Shoreham and Sea. 
bang in the ear. So the song I'm going to sing for Judy is called Rain in California. And it goes, They say the rain is warm in California. They say the weather is pleasant over there. But if you go, don't tell me I didn't warn you. California is a long, long way from here. Though you may see the sunset on the Pacific, and you may taste the wine. They grow there. They say you'll miss your friends and your relation, and the taste of mist on the west of Ireland. A man may rob your wallet or your home. They burgle your house while you're in bed asleep. But if you steal a generation's future, that takes a very special type of thief. For that's what they've done in Paris and in Brussels. Our children away to find the work. A diaspora nation once again. So fare thee well, you brave Irish rovers. Goodbye, you wild colonial boys and girls. Blow a dandelion in the wind. Its seeds are spread all around the world. They say the rain is warm in California. They say the weather is pleasant over there. But if you go, don't tell me I didn't warn you. California is a long, long way from here. There we go, especially for you, Judy. You're feeling homesick? Well, it's not that great here, Judy. We're all locked up. It's pretty, pretty much the same in California. We've got the same TV. We've got the same shops. We've probably got, you know, American apparel. We've got the same rubbish on the television. Just, and anyway, you can be wherever you want because you're online. So there we go. That's probably my only song tonight. I mean, it's, it's an Irish night, so it's going to be songs about Ireland and um, Irish singers. I've got some kind of curveball y kind of stuff that I've not, not done before. But I'm going to sing a song written by a guy called Dominic Bien, which is about my grandfather's generation. Uh, my grandfather came over in the 1920s uh, and uh, dug the roads, and uh, as many Irish people did, and uh, they worked very hard. And uh, this song was written by Dominic Bien, and it's called McAlpine's Fusiliers. Went down the glen came McAlpine's men with their shovels slung behind them. Twas in the pub that they drank their sub, and out on the spike you will find them. I sweated blood, and I washed down mud with pints and quarts of beer. 
And now we're on the road again With my Calpine's fusilier I remember the day that the bearer shade Fell into a concrete stair What horse face said when they saw him dead It wasn't what the Brits called prayers I'm a navvy short was a one retort that reached unto my ears. If you value your life, don't join by Christ to the Calpine's fusilier. I stripped to the skin with the darky fin, way down on the Isle of Grain. With horse face so too, we knew the rule. No money if you stopped for a break. In England, the nanny it was done to try and send a few bob back home. And woe to he who asked for tea with McAlpine. If you value your life, don't join by Christ to McAlpine's fusiliers. So there's a little song about a family history. The um, It was McAlpine, the big company, you know, the construction company that brought them over. And then they dug all the tunnels underneath the tents. They did all the work. They built England. They built the railway station. And uh, that's why London is the biggest Irish city in the world. You might think Dublin is, or you, you might even think that Boston is, or, or Chicago, but there's like so many Irish people and people of Irish extraction in London. And um, the Pogues movie is great because it talks about that stuff because when you, we, we didn't really hear kind of that kind of music on the radio here. It wasn't, it was kind of frowned upon and it was kind of immigrant music. And so... If you wait, if, I never really heard it in public, apart from my mother had a few records by a group called the Clancy Brothers and Tommy Makem. And um, so when I first moved to London, I found that there was Irish pubs that had all these songs on the jukebox, and it was brilliant, you know. It was kind of discovering, because I, the bed set that I moved to when I first came to London was um, in Kilburn. And it was, um, uh, yeah, it was like kind of, was like living in Ireland, really, and uh, except that um, you're in England. So there's there's a story from my family, and I'm, I'm just going to think of something nice. I've got a nice one here. This one is um, something I did for the movie as well, and this is called um, this is called uh, the uh, the Star of the County Down, and it's if you really want to hear a great version of this. This is a, uh, Van Morrison does a fantastic version of this with the Chieftains. And I'm, I'm going to cheat a little bit because I've got a nice bit of backing track that I did for the movie. That it's going to be, if you see the movie, you'll hear this in the background. Can you hear it? Town in the county down one morning last July. From a boring green came a sweet Polly, and she smiled as she passed me by. She looked so sweet from her two bare feet to the sheen of an up brown hair. Such a coaxing out, sure I shook myself to see if I was really there. From Bantry Bear to Derry Cay, from Galway to Dublin Town. Maid I've seen like the sweet Colleen that I met at the county down. As she onward sped, sure I scratched my head and I looked with a feeling rare. And I said, said I to the passerby, who's the maid with the nut brown hair? He smiled at me and he said, says he, 
That's the gem of Ireland's crown. Young Rosie McCann from the banks of the band is the star of the county down. From Bantry Bay up to Derry Cay, from Galway to Dublin town. No maid I've seen like the brown Colleen that I met at the county down. At the harvest fair she'll be surely there in a dress in her Sunday clothes. My shoes sharp bright and my cut cock bright and a smile for my nut brown rose. No pipe I'll smoke, no horse I'll yoke till my rust turns pale coloured brown. Till the smiling bride is by my own fireside, sits the far of the county down. From Bantry Bay to Derry Cay, from Baldwin to Dublin town. No maid I've seen like the brown Colleen. That I met at the county down. Well, of course, I have my own colleague downstairs. For Sheila's family is from round about the county down. From Bantry Bay to Derry Cay, from Galway to Dublin town. No maid I've seen like the sweet Colleen that I met at the county down. Beautiful mandolins tell the story of love. I'm sure he did do a gone not great version. So this is No maid I've seen like the sweet Colleen that I met at the county down. There we go. What a lovely song. And that is a song from the north part of the country. And uh, I just really love it. Uh, and I've got another one here that's kind of slightly a bit more difficult, but I'm going to attempt it. And this is a Clancy Brothers one, or Liam Clancy had a hit with it. I hope, Rory Byrne, you're listening. This is your culture here, Rory. And this is... Um, an arrangement I did for the movie, or as you say in Ireland, the film. And this is um, called, um, this is a lovely little song called The Parting Glass. And I'm just going to sing along with what I recorded because you never hear what I recorded. Um, because there'll be somebody, Shay McGowan will be talking over the top of this or whatever. And the movie is really, I, mean, I can't underestimate how brilliant the film, it's probably one of the best films I've ever worked on. You get the chance to see it. Sheila and I are watching it tomorrow and we have a special Irish lunch. Now here we're going, uh, this one is uh, The Parting Glass, this is a goodbye thing. We're not going to say goodbye yet because we're only halfway through the show but... Sorry, 
got my going away. I know the sweethearts I've ever had. They would wish me one more day to stay. But since it falls unto my lot that I should rise and you should not, I'll simply rise and gently fall. Good night and joy be with you all. Goes on a bit longer than a little gap there. If I had money enough to spend and leisure time to sit. There's a fair maid sitting downstairs Who surely has my heart beguiled Her rosy cheeks and ruby lips I own she has my heart in full so fill me now the parting glass and night and dark be with you all Are you crying yet? Oh, I think it's I mean it's like what I say about cave on we're kind of luxuriating in slightly maudlin Irish music and I have some more punky stuff coming up but it's kind of nice to do that because it's got there's something that's really lovely about it and tonight I've got to sing along to with a piece of music that you wouldn't normally hear and that's what I do in my studio here with my little mandolins there's a little bit of magic here so what am I going to do next I've got loads of kind of different songs it's been quite difficult getting getting choosing the ones because I've got lots of Irish songs and, and there's something here that's quite interesting now I won't do that yet there's yeah there's a really horrible song here actually there's a really now we've had this kind of this is kind of Irish punk rock when we were growing up we had this song <laughs> An old woman who lived in the wood, weed a weed a while, yeah. There was an old woman who lived in the wood, down by the riverside, yeah. She had a baby three months old, weed a weed a while, yeah. She had a baby three months old, down by the riverside, yeah. She had a pen knife long and sharp, weed a weed a while, yeah. She had a pen down by the riverside, yeah. She stuck the knife in the baby's heart. Wheeler, wheeler, wire. Yeah. She stuck the knife in the baby's heart. Down by the riverside, yeah. Three policemen and a detective for me. Wheeler, wheeler, wire. Yeah. Three policemen and a detective for me came knocking at her door. They pulled the rope and she was found. Down by the river side, yeah. And that's the end of the woman in the woods. We love, we love, yeah. And that's the end of the other baby, too. Down by the river side, yeah. That kind of broke the spell. A bit of horror, kind of murder, punk Irish music. And um, 
let's get something a bit more rocking up here i've got some great things coming up for you some of it it's a bit experimental but i think we're going to do some tin lizzy let's get some tin lizzy up and running because this is a great this is a nice adventure of a song and where is it going uh, where is the song oh yeah here we go there. this is great you will we'll all know this one and this is about a kind of a hijacking as I was going over the Cork and Kerry Mountain, I saw Captain Farrell and his money he was counting. I first produced my pistol, then I produced my rapier. I said, stand and deliver, for the devil he will take you for a whack on a two dollar dog. Whack for my daddy, oh. Daddy, oh, there's risky in the job. I took all of his money, it was a pretty penny. I took all of his money and I brought it home to Molly. She swore that she would love me and she would never leave me. But the devil take that woman, cause I know she tricked me easy with a whack on a dumb dog. Whack for my daddy O, oh. whack for my daddy O, oh. there's whiskey in the jar. Well, being drunk and weary, I went to Molly's chamber, taking Molly with me, cause I never knew the danger. Well, back four, five, six, or seven, well, it walked Captain Farrell. I jumped up and fired my pistols, and I shot it with both barrels. For Whack for my daddy O, oh. whack for my daddy O, oh. there's whiskey in the jar. Now some men they like fishing, and some men they like fowling, and some men like to hear the cannonball a howling. Oh, me, I like to sleep in, in my Molly's chamber, but here I am in prison with a ball of chain to hold me with a whack. get involved in a hijack situation in the Cork and Kerry Mountains don't give your money to Molly because she's no good she might be a bit old now but she's probably still up to her tricks there we go and um, now I'm going to do something really um, something a bit experimental I've got a new fiddle thing I've never sung this before and I suddenly thought, you know what? It wouldn't be right without the Belfast Cowboy and Kayvon. Where is Kayvon? Is he here? He ordered up this tune, man. It's like somebody's at the restaurant and he's ordered up a tune. And, and I even got a special sound for it, I think. Does it bass and brass? Yeah, well, let's try it anyway. This is shame on you, Kayvon, if you're not here because this is your tune, man. Let's see if it's... Yeah, come on, we're getting this, we're getting this, uh, we're going to get the... Uh, do -do -do -do. Do -do 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 -do. oh no, I've got to tune down to D on this one. Because I've got a killer bass line on this. Do you like this one? This is a great song. Um, when the... Dexy's Night Runners did their version on Top of the Pops. The um, the people on Top of the Pops had a pig picture of a Scottish darts player with no teeth. You'll probably understand why they did it, but... <laughs> Jackie Wilson says, Read Patrice, Cattled up your body, but you knock me out my feet. Let it all hang out. Let it all hang out. Ding a ling a ling a ling a ling a ling. Ding a ling a ling a ling a ling a ling. Let it all hang out. Let it all hang out. I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. When you smile. That room make my heart go boom, boom, boom. Let it all hang out. 
they all hang out. And every time you look that way, kind of love you, baby, baby, make my day. Let it all hang out. Let it all hang out. the um, regular little updates nobody's talking or maybe nobody is talking we've got the new black and white t-shirts you're right now I'm going to do something experimental and this is something definitely I've not done before and it's in a funny key as well I think it's in E flat and um, I kind of just learnt it this afternoon and it's kind of might go terribly wrong but we couldn't just do one Van Morrison song we had to do two and the second one is something quite extraordinary and it's called this one we were born it's kind of nice it's got like a boat in it Where's the word? Where's the lyrics? Come on, JC, where's the lyrics? We were born before the wind. It's called, I might as well tell you, it's called Into the Whist Mystic, and I've never sung it before in my life. And there it is. Oh, it's beautiful. And it's got a foghorn. And when the foghorn blows, you've got to go. Rawr. We were born before the wind. Also younger than the sun when the bonny boat was flung and we sailed into the mystic Hark I hear the sailors cry smell the sea and feel the sky and let your soul and spirit fly into the mystic. Fog on now. When that fog on blows, I'll be coming home. When that fog on blows, I want to hear it. As we magnificently flow into the mystic, we were born before the wind, all so younger than the sun. Ere the body book was won, as we sail into the mystic. 
Hark, I hear the sailors cry Smell the sea and feel the sky And let your soul, let your soul and spirit fly Into the mystic When that far car blows, I'll be coming home. When that far car blows, I want to hear it, don't want to fear it. And I will rock your very soul. Just lay back and think of the days of old. As we sail and we magnificently, as we magnificently flow into the mystic. kind of that is a world what a beautiful song it is and i didn't know rob that south side johnny does a great version it's from i think an album called saint dominic's preview which is a wonderful record i used to listen to before i was a punk and everything and i thought it was just great now let's do some punk, irish punk rock we got time for a bit of irish punk rock and then we do finish with a big number oh cave on i sang the Jackie Wilson for you, man. You can listen to it on Rewind. Now, where's this other one? This, this, oh yeah, here's the one. We're going to do a scratchy punk. Because we're doing, we're doing Ireland, but we're doing quite a lot of Northern Ireland. And I don't mind that. This is a bit of Northern Ireland. And we're going to turn all the synths off when we're going to go get the plectrum out. Because we're not doing a wet acoustic song. We're going... do it I won't do it well maybe I should do it this is this is a great story about this song I played with the, this band in Belfast and um, I felt I said oh I really loved playing in Belfast because my granny came from there and they said to me where did she go to school I don't know what they were on about anyway there's nothing for us in Belfast do it better but I didn't go and we did play with them and I'm kind of I've got something really a massive song for you now and people are going to either go oh no they're going to be like what's he doing this for I hate this band but I kind of liked it and it's I guess it's a guilty pleasure and this is kind of a cool song and I, well, let's see what you think I've got a special sound for it, so I'm going to do the special groovy sound. 
we not get rid of that. We've not had that sound. We're going to have this sound called apathy. Actually, I want to do two more songs. <laughs> Okay, here's the song. Here's the big song. This is the big one. This is for Judy as well, because I know she's, I don't know, she's getting two songs tonight. And where is it? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I know she likes them. Uh, here we go, here we go. This is your song for you tonight. <laughs> Guess what song I'm playing? Not really Keating. Is it getting any better? Or do you feel the same? Will it make it any easier for you? If you got someone to blame, you say, my love, that's what one need in the night. One love, we get to share it. If it leaves you, baby, you don't have to care for it. Did I disappoint you or leave a bad taste in your mouth? You act like you've never been had love. Do you want me to go without? Well, it's too late tonight to drag the past up out into your life. Have you come here for forgiveness? Have you come to raise the dead? Have you come here to play Jesus to the lepers in your head? Did I disappoint you or leave a bad taste in your mouth you act like you never had love you want me to go without well it's too late Should have been the thing, so I'm going to leave you with one song. 
because guys you've been a fantastic audience tonight and I'm going to leave you the song which was written by a contemporary of my grandmother's from the mountains from the Dremlins of Monaghan let's turn up the thing the mountains of Monaghan on Raglan Road on a November day I first saw her and you that her back hair would weave a snare that I would one day rule. I saw. very much everybody I know it was a bit up and down but I really appreciate you guys coming to the show and especially the guys that come and pay me a bit of money and um, next week maybe punk rock thank you Chris Thomas and um, we'll see you all next week guys thank you so much one love um, two love three love lots of love 32 loves 33 loves so many of you online thank you so much guys I'll see you later take care <laughs>